हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज़ अ सोल्यूशन वीडियो फॉर क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन चैप्टर फाइव एस सी वर्मा द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट से इज ए पेंडुलम बॉब ऑफ मास फिफ्टी ग्राम इज सस्पेंडेड फ्रॉम द सीलिंग ऑफ एन एलिवेटर फाइंड द टेंशन इन द स्ट्रिंग इफ द एलिवेटर ए गोज अप विद एक्सेलरेशन वन पॉइंट टू मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वेयर बी गोज अप विद डिसलरेशन वन पॉइंट टू मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वेयर सी गोज अप विद यूनिफॉर्म विलासिटी डी गोज डाउन विद एक्सेलरेशन वन पॉइंट टू मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वेयर E goes down with deceleration 1.2 meter per second square and F goes down with uniform velocity. Okay, so in this case, uh, say there is an elevator. So let's say this is an elevator, and there is a pendulum bob hanging from the ceiling of this elevator. So in any case, there will always be a mg force downward acting on this bob, and the tension T in the string. okay so depending on the different different scenario either the elevator is going up or down with uniform velocity up and down we can easily solve this problem okay so the first part is a when it goes up with acceleration 1.2 meter per second square so in this case the elevator is going up so for that the equation is going to be t minus mg is equal to mass into acceleration okay so this is going to be t is equal to mg plus ma so that means m times g plus a now mass is 50 g that means 0.05 kg so 0.05 kg times g is 9.8 plus 1.2 is 11 so the answer is going to be 0.55 newton fine for the b part this time it is going up with deceleration of 1.2 meter per second square so in this case also it is going up so the equation is going to be t minus mg and it is equal to m times minus a because this time it is deceleration fine so this is going to be t is equal to mg minus ma so that m minus a or 0.05 into 9.8 minus 1.2 is 8.6 so it is going to be 0.43 newton c part in this case uh, it is going up with uniform velocity if it is going with uniform velocity that means the acceleration is zero so i can say t minus mg is equal to m times zero that means zero so so this is equal to t is equal to mg or 0.05 into 9.8 that means 0.49 newton now the d part now in this case it is going down with acceleration 1.2 meter per second square so if it is going downward so in that case mg minus t is equal to mass into acceleration okay so that means t is equal to mg minus ma and that is going to be i have solved this mg minus ma over over here so the answer is going to be 0.43 newton for the e part now in this case it is going down with the deceleration of 1.2 meter per second square so that means now the elevator is going downward so mg minus t is equal to m times minus a so this is going to be t is equal to mg plus ma so we have solved this mg plus ma over here so that means answer is going to be 0.55 newton now the last part f is now in this case it goes down with uniform velocity now in this case it is going downward with uniform velocity that means the acceleration is zero so mg minus t is equal to zero or t is equal to mg that means so we have solved this t is equal to mg over here so the answer is going to be 0.49 newton so this is the solution of this problem